Hello, friends. Hope everyone is doing well. Hope you're all tucked in bed and... I don't know. Like, hanging out with your pets and... My cat is... Chilling in what used to be my chair. Uh, it is uh, not anymore, because uh, I guess you wanted it. But, ooh, magic missiles. I'm always down for a magic missile start. But yeah, uh, it's been less than three months, and in fact, it's only been a couple days since my last run. But I'm thinking we kind of do something kind of standard. Um, it's, uh, you know, I think with all the DLC content and stuff like that, and all the uh, alternate endings to the game, like, I definitely want to go back to my roots as a 5DC player, and I think it'll be fun. So we'll, we'll go standard this route. We'll see if I want to go to the Castlevania part, though. But uh, I'm thinking maybe not. I think maybe we just go the optimal route and get as many scrolls as we can. Just kind of make it like a kind of a typical tactics run. Nope. Got a sit little fake out there. All right. Now, magic missiles is really good for this. Like, you just kind of like move around and you get to do a bunch of shenanigans. It's 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 really good. I, I enjoy the weapon a lot. Nope. I think I did. I whiff on like every shot there. That's funny. Uh, the cross, yeah, the cross. I think it's pretty good. Let's check if I'm recording. Yes, yes, I am. But yes, I do think Toxic Sewers is the play here. Cause I like Toxic Sewers. It's a fun level, especially with magic missiles. You just get to watch everything just explode. It's great. I don't like Lex Hugger. Like, you have to ramp it up for so long, and... I don't know, you, like, you have to get, like, a level 7 or 11, level 8, even, for it to, like, come to fruition, and I don't know. I don't think it's very good. It's just a bit annoying to you. It's okay, I got 50% healing. I'm gonna be healed to full after this. I am not worried one bit. I just can't get hit again. And, because I forgot that I did not have a shield. Yeah, yeah, I, you know, you know, it shit happens. It's alright. But I am long distance here. Nope. Okay. Oh, how the fuck am I gonna do this? Like that. Okay, so this is every melee attack, right? Yeah, I'm I'm switching to electrodynamics. I'm not I'm not taking anything here. No point. So someone in my last video commented that uh, apparently the uh, mimics you can tell because there's a hidden, uh, a hidden lore room. Now, I'll be quite frank with you guys. I, I do not trust myself to find any little, uh, hidden lore rooms uh, because I suck at those things. Um, that's going to be our first lead, which is slightly alarming, but we will figure it out. Come on. I put him in a position where he could just not hit me, and no nothing could. That's, that's a wonderful feeling. Okay, how do I want to do this? Okay, well, I missed completely the cross. That's all right. Um, I still have a chance for 30, depending on how many enemies are here. If I have six enemies... Well, that also includes the elite, doesn't it? So... I don't think I have a chance at a 30. Come on. Okay, that was stupid. But, doesn't matter. Got him. Take that out. Yeah, there is 30. There is 30. Uh, that screws up my... my uh, It does kind of screw up my double stat scroll thing, but it's fine. I need to remember to heal. Is 
So if you're wondering why I am still taking this challenge rift, even though I'm more or less guaranteed to get the um, dual stat scroll on the next level, ultimately your chances of getting both and your chances of getting none, I think need to be considered in this. So if you don't know, if you have the same amount of scrolls, and I think this only works with like with the amulets, like once you start getting two uh, two scrolls on your amulets at the beginning. So I think that would be like three or four BC. Um, you end up in a position where you can get two in one stat on your scroll, like I have here. And so you're supposed to end up with uh, 133. And so the game doesn't know if you have. Um, I have to the game doesn't know if you have the. Uh, which stat you have. So in this case, it'd be either tactics or survival. So the next level, basically, there's a chance that like you end up with both dual stat scrolls in your favor. Normally, you wouldn't. And there's a smaller chance that you kind of end up with one. Uh, but sometimes you end up with nothing. And the chance of getting both is kind of small so point being extra gold from the amulet plus which is very valuable in toxic source plus the fact that you know you get the um plus the fact that you get some i don't know it's fun i don't know what the hell i'm saying uh I don't have any blueprints. That's not. Actually. I'm gonna keep everything as is. I'm, I'm gonna go for this. But yeah, because I took the thing, I took the challenge rift, I won't be having that uh, opportunity. Uh, so now I have to rely on one dual stat scroll, which is just seed dependent. That extra lightning is really gonna come to me. Okay, there should be a little knucklehead around here somewhere. I need to go to a safer location. that to expire. Okay. Good. Yeah, there was basically no uh, guarantee that I would have ended up with both stats in my favor. If the game interpreted it as, like, me getting, like, the wrong stats, so to speak, then, like, I would have kind of ended up screwed a little bit. So, where are you? Oh, it wasn't here. Okay. Off to a decent start. No, you're not here. Oh. Okay, got him kind of locked in there. Good. Let's get rid of you. Just playing fast and loose, right? Fast and loose. Playing about as relaxed as it gets. I, this is one thing that Taxi is really good at is kind of brainless play once you figure out your synergies and stuff. But the early game uh, can be kind of difficult because you're taking a lot of damage from a lot of things. Um, especially when you end up in positions like that because uh, Scorpions hit really, really hard. Did I activate the teleporter over there? No, and I need to grab that scroll later. Ooh, I rolled real early there. The lag has been really bad. Like, like it can get kind of frustrating. Like, it, it's just uh, entering a room type of lag. That electrodynamics is like doing a sneaky amount of damage. If I get something with like 
electrified damage, then I'm good to go. So it does crit on burn, right? Yeah. I need to figure out a way to get burn on these. Maybe a firebrands or something would be good. Like Hugger, huh? Oh no, that's Star Fury. I'm good. Star Fury is extremely good in certain parts. Uh, not my favorite weapon to use. Uh, can't quite tell you why. It's not bad by any means. I just don't like using it. I mean, well, that's not true. I do like using it, but it can get a bit annoying. Oh, I didn't realize that that can work well for that. Is that scroll in my favor? Okay. So that challenge rift was absolutely worth it then. Like, just numbers wise, absolutely worth it. Let the crow's foot and damage over time from the electricity take care of that. Wave of denial. I I like my loadout. I actually really like it. I just need to get some synergy and I'm good. Who's at the bottom? It's been a while since I used this weapon. Luckily for me, Vampire Killer is part tactic, so I'm able to. I mean, that's why I grabbed it. I wouldn't have otherwise. I mean, synergy isn't everything. I mean, you, you gotta have some sort of like damage or some sort of scroll count. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, uh, yes. I'm not confident in myself. Let's crack my knuckles there. But you know what? What's the worst that's gonna happen is that I lose at a children's video game, right? Dead Cells is not a children's video game. But, like, you get what I'm saying. Maybe the series will be. I don't know if it'll be family friendly. I don't know. Are you guys... I'm not doing that. I, I don't care if you comment about the uh, animated series in the channel. Um, but I, I'm not going there. I, I'm not checking if there's a lore room. Um, but thank you to the guy who told me um, that it existed. That actually was very much appreciated. I cannot fall. No shit. Okay. Don't fall, don't fall. Nope. Nice! That was a good curse clear. That's a that's a really good curse clear. I'm super proud of that. I know that if there's one more scroll I need to grab. Ooh, I grabbed that just in time. I was about to get smacked in the face, huh? Uh So what does the uh, discard do? Destroys all active orbs. That'd be good versus the boss. 421 is really good. Um, that, Cause that's a total of like... Oh. All right, we gotta set you over somewhere. Oh, that hit me? Yeah, good thing I wasn't cursed. Uh, do I wanna take that? No reason to. Where are you? There you are. I love Magic Missile just because of the hang time. Like, it's so good. Uh, we are gonna grab that. Good. Good run so far. 
just for extra health in case I get smacked. Is it more health? Six points. Eight. It doesn't matter in the long run, but. Okay. Oh, this is the triple jump section. So you don't actually need the triple jump. Um, you just need to time it right. Basically, right as you go down, that's when you gotta jump. Because then you still get the double jump without the, uh... Um... Yeah, because... Yeah, you still get the double jump. You just... Uh, normally, like... Like, if you drop down like that, you only get the single jump, but... Or, I don't know if I'm explaining it right, but, yeah. It's hard to show it here. I'm gonna go to Ramparts anyway, so I'll show you guys there. Okay. So 10 is really good for Corrupted Prison. I am worried about my weapon. Although, no, I don't need to. I I have uh, Vampire Killer for the uh, crabs. I am going to check out the shop because I never actually did. No lore room. I mean, I should check that lore room, actually. Now that I have Instinct on. So I don't see anything, but it doesn't mean anything. I don't know. <laughs> I clicked the wrong thing. Because I have 27,000 in gold. Like, I should go spend my money. I have level 4 weapons right now. Like, everything is level 4 except for my vampire killer. And I barely used it. Do I want boomerang? No. I do like boomerang though. Ooh, Ewit. I say we do take this. Instead of missile. There's no, I don't think there's a mimic here. He would have come out. We just go double whip here. Yeah, I like that. That's kind of nice. Where am I going? Corrupted prison? Where's the... There it is. Level 8 weapon, always a good thing. So you can go up to level 14 because when you kill the Mimic, mimic you have to be in a graveyard or the 5DC... Or not in graveyard, in a cavern or the 5DC area. That's the only way to do it. Oh. Huh? I'm gonna say yes, because I think it'll be good. I mean, <laughs> that's why, I mean, that's generally why you think what you take weapons. That's kind of a nothing statement, but I'm gonna go point blank here. Um, the reason is, uh, I don't have any synergy for my vampire kill. It's a very good weapon, but... It's a lot like oil sword, you need to get things going. Like, I would rather take more damage with my tranquility than... Or with my point blank and all that stuff than... You know. I'm gonna keep that in the back. That actually might be okay. I think Balance Blade is a really good tactics weapon anyways, even though it's not. is basically if your ranged attacks tend to um hold on let me i'm gonna grab another one of these i almost uh fucked that up okay I 
do need to activate these guys. Come on, get your back, buddy. Why was I scared that he was gonna hit me? Like, there was no shot at him hitting me there. But the game, I guess, uh, I guess uh, I have uh, some unresolved uh, issues with this game, I suppose. Oh, God. Uh, ow. It didn't actually hit me as hard as I thought it would. I think they might have nerfed the damage of this guy. Uh, I really should heal at some point. Wait, I can just, yeah. Actually, do I want to go grand cards? Or do I care more about being optimal? Ah, uh, yeah. No, I'm 100% I'm taking that. I'm just going to place that down for the final one. Alright, let's go heal. Uh, better if I go to the shop. That's like a perfect Tesla coil. Now I just need to match up my shit to get like... I need to get something. Something to boost my DOT because this electrodynamics is doing quite well. I'm actually liking it a lot, but um, it does have its flaws. And its flaw being that it is a bit passive and I don't really want to use Foresight. Foresight isn't bad, but Generally, it's not something I would want to use all the time, if that makes sense. I think we just, there's two shops in here, so I'm just gonna make use of that. Uh, I think support would work well. I think that balances it out very nicely with Tesla. That Tesla coil is not going anywhere. That's scary. Yeah, that was that was annoying. It's like, dude, make up your mind. Okay. He came a little bit faster than I thought he was going to. Uh no. It would be so nice if the electric weapons could self-synergize, but then again, it's like pyrotechnics doing 30% damage to uh burning enemies. It's kind of pointless, isn't it? I mean, it's pointless. It, it's just, it's like undeserved uh, damage, basically. Hell yeah. I'll sell that in the mean. In the meanwhile. Oh. Oh, I pierce. I didn't realize I had pierce. That's good. So, basically, Ancient Sewers is one giant game of grab-ass with the Impalers. Um, that's the easiest way to interpret it. I'm gonna wait down here. I can actually pick that up before I leave the biome, assuming I make it through. But 13 is a good spot to be in. Um, we're gonna go right. Okay, never mind. when that thing doesn't like spawn the way like it just ugh. 
I gotta wait. I don't like waiting. I have all three keys, which is nice. So if I accidentally hit the exit, I should be okay. Last few updates have been very good, though. Like, they've been just... Like, I, I really like the uniqueness of the new weapons. Not all of them are, are good. But that's alright. I mean, that's just, you know, how video games work. That's why tier lists exist, even though I don't personally like them, but, you know, it's whatever. I like watching them. But, like, even my ranking videos, like, yeah, I, I did put a lot of work into it, but, like, it's just... I, you probably won't see one from me anytime soon, unless I really get back into the channel, because it's just a lot of work. Ooh, um, oh. Uh, I don't have Vampire Killer, what the hell am I doing? Okay. So no dual stat scrolls, that's alright. I do need, I do need the health, so that's fine. You know what I really need to do again? I, I was doing this. For a few videos, um, I need to. Um, should I grab that? Does that do what I want it to do, though? Like, because the point of point blank is that I'm close range. That I, there's no point in having this at close range. You might as well just go melee. So I don't think that's a good idea. Quick bow, on the other hand, is actually good. I need to get rid of those biters. I'm gonna say no to that. I, I'm being picky. I'm v very aware of that. See, I just, I don't know. I'm just, I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling it. I think the loadout's doing fine. Who is it? Good. Okay. I love that that hits in between platforms. Like, that's so good. Go away, bank guy. Might I actually go to bank this time? Maybe. If the game is nice to me. Because while I do like my loadout, I 100% know it can be better, and this is not a very good late game loadout, because outside of the Nerves of Steel and Tesla Coil, which is, again, on a cooldown, um, I do need some better form of damage here. I do need to ramp up the damage in some way, shape, or form. It should be fine versus Kanji. I don't anticipate it being a big deal, but, you know, obviously you don't want to hinge on that entirely. Cleared. Right, Yumi's not bad. Um, I want to see what the balance blade gives me, because balance blade would actually do quite nicely. Let's see what this has in store for me. Okay, that was a one shot. Alright, so. Ooh. So that's really good. Do I take that instead of the electrodynamics? Is the question. Because I, I want to keep that Tesla Coil. That self synergy is really good. Yeah. I take it instead of Electro. And I take nothing else. Electrodynamics, you served me well. Thank you. You're a very good skill. 
Uh, we are gonna take the infected. And we are gonna take that. And we still have to go to one more. Hey, here's the thing. Oh, okay, I do wanna I do wanna see what's in that uh chest. But like the thing is, there's an elite down there. I am very scared. Okay, that could have been way worse. I just got I got really unlucky there. Uh with the elite ability, it was uh, it was really hard to like move out and yeah, that just sucks. That's okay, though. Like, not the worst thing in the world. I'm at 59% health. Uh, I get to go heal soon. Actually, that's a lie. I won't be able to heal. Uh, well, actually, no, I can. So, I did get some recovery back. I didn't lose that much HP in the long run. It's fine. Is there any more healing that I can do in here? I don't think so. Yeah, let's just get out of here. I want to see what that balance blade gives me. How is this? Not good. Oh, I want to be better than Tussle, but I'm sure. We'll do one more. I have nothing. All right, fine. We go in with this loadout. I don't like Bible. I mean, I, I know it's good, but like, I just, I just, it, I, I just, it's so weird to use. I'm sure it's good. I just, I don't know. Probably better at survival. What do I have? Stuns the victim. I will take that instead of this. Um, you know, the thing is, I don't necessarily need Tranquility. Like, I will be just fine without it. Because, I, you know, I got points like I'm not going to bank. I didn't check my scroll count. 18 is good. It should be at like 22, 23. Very good on this level. That could have been bad. No, I heard spikes. Shit. I need to make sure that I don't goof this. I'm just gonna check what's here. 
And then I'll come back after the level's done. Man, this is not good so far. Okay, there's another shot. I'm, I'm not gonna grab anything, I don't need to. I wanna save my money. Is this uh, an extra man? Not gonna concern myself over there. I kind of have to do this, don't I? Oh, you're there somewhere. Yes! Awesome. Okay. So, there's an elite over there. I want to fight that. Uh, We'll go in here first. We'll grab the item. I know I'm being, like, a bit over-careful right now, but, like, I mean, you can't blame me, right? Great RNG this run, I'll say that much. I think my pickups have been mostly me taking advantage of them. Just adapting on the fly a lot in this game. Okay. Bro, they keep giving me the same fucking thing. I'm gonna take that. 25% reduction is really good. Cool. Ooh, okay, I gotta watch out for that. That, uh, vertical attack that Gollum does. That's scary shit. It's down and to the left. Okay. Okay. Doing okay so far. We're hanging in there. So let me know, like, if you're this far into the video, I mean, clearly you like my content. Uh, so, do you want me to upload a video in which I had all legendary items? Now, the run itself is a bit scuffed. Um, it is, it was very fun. I mean, that's the most important thing, is that it was very fun. But, um, not my best run ever. Um, but I was gonna do post commentary on it. Um, I ended up with the Money Shooter, uh, which is an insane item. Um, when you do it right. Okay, that was, I was, that was, that was, wow, that, that shield, man. Shields are underrated as far as enemies. Come on. Where are you, big guy? Sometimes you just gotta know where the enemy is gonna spawn. 
or you gotta just know where your enemies are. Like that's why I was able to do that. Like I just knew where he was, so I just got the, I just hit him pretty hard. Huh? it like an idiot. <laughs> I was just like, please, please die. Nice little trick shot that I got in there. That's just making use of that double jump shenanigan. Uh, I'm gonna stay away from you. Okay. Uh oh, I need to grab that tool. Go do that. It's a good sanctuary. I'm happy with that. 23. Just like I predicted. So I believe it's typically plus 5. Plus whatever equals that scroll you get. Do I need to heal? Yeah, I need to heal. Oh, fuck me. I gotta run all the way back and grab that. I think when you have explorers and things, you should be able to teleport anywhere on the map. Because I'm lazy. Uh, oh. We can get some extra money here. So, I'm being a bit, um... I'm not spending my money because I want to get stuff in cavern and level 12 weapons, potentially level 14, is always a really nice thing to have. Is there anything else I need to do in here? I don't think so. I'm not killing those final enemies. That take, that's too much effort. Alright, cavern. Oh, I guess I haven't been there in a really long time. Yeah, that's yeah, that actually makes sense because I've been doing lots of like queen. Um, stuff and lots. Yeah, I haven't been going to cavern all that much. So, like, I could pick that up, right? Like, but what would be the point? Let me keep that in the back, because I don't. I, don't, I mean, I don't. I just don't know what I want to do with some of these weapons. But I do need to figure out some synergy, because otherwise, uh, the thing with Giant is that like when you have synergy on tactics, he's, he's kind of a joke. But like if you don't, then like, you need to figure it out. Marksman bow, not gonna cut it. So I am getting extra money though, so that's gonna be really good. So things to watch out for in this level: arbiters for sure, um, and the rhinos, because. They are going to smack me in the face if I am not careful, which, I mean, that's a given anyways, but regardless, like, um, because I have one weapon that can hit him from the back in my electric whip, but electric whip is more of like, it's, it's I mean, it's great. It's an amazing item, um, potentially S tier, but like, you know, I don't have the synergy to justify it having... Yeah, see, like, right there. Like, you don't want to screw that up. I mean, it's fine. Let's just wait on you. Alright, good. I 
I need to play a little faster. So let's just do that. So, rhinos are not that bad with stuff like this. All you gotta do is just, uh... Um, you, you just gotta roll away. Like, it's not a super big deal. I'm already on two stacks, what the hell? Okay, or I just completely whip. Dude, the malaise ramped up real quick. Yeah, it wasn't just me. Yeah, they need a they need another malaise. Like it, it's it's actually got worse. Like like it, it it's a bit tedious at this point. Ah, I did not time that well. Yeah, like, this is- it's kind of annoying, honestly, like... Like, I'm not taking hits, it's just more time-consuming, and it happens every, like, two seconds. They, they, they need to rework it, like... Like, I don't want to have to, like, play every move so deliberately and slowly. Like, it's definitely gotten way worse. Alright, let's see what we get. So we have two skill shops. Not a huge deal if I don't get the first. I'm gonna take that. Okay, so no mimic here. But I feel like a mimic would have already come, right? I am gonna take this, but um potentially. I also need an elite. I have not fought an elite yet. That's done is really helpful. Okay. Man, my amulet luck is just dog shit this, this run. Like, I have had a total of, um, like, yeah, it's it's been bad. Like, I have had the highest being one, one scroll in my amulet. I mean, the run's going well, so, I mean, there's worse things than that, than the luck I'm having, but, like... Uh, sometimes you just have bad RNG in a run, like, shit happens, you know? Nerves actually would have been better than Marksman's here, but I, I'm- if I'm going to the shop anyways. I could pot it. I am actually thinking of it right now because I'm getting a bit annoyed right now. Yeah, we're potting it. I'm just- I'm, I don't want to deal with this. Stats scroll might be right. Good. I'm surprised that uh, he didn't see me. Yeah, I can, I can pot it. Like, I, I don't need to necessarily, like... This is good exploiting of the enemies on this level. So slammers don't get stunned, so I do need to watch out for that, but okay, let's see what we have. No, none of these. No, uh? <laughs> Not taking a 300% one, I'll tell you that much. So this could be good, right? Take this. Yeah. 
Get the initial damage with my electric whip. Use the cross for bulkier enemies. Yeah, I'm, I can do that. The shrapnel buying that was kind of pointless, but it's fine. It's not a big deal. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, that's gonna work out nicely for me. Yeah, that's a, that's a lot of damage. That would have been, yeah, I'm already almost at two layer. Yeah, that, that's really broken. They need to fix the next update. It's gotten worse since that change initially happened. I've never liked the change. I always thought it was a bad change because like, it doesn't actually make the game harder. Like it just makes it more tedious. But like, whatever, like you learn to live with changes, right? Like it's factors beyond your control and all that. But like, um, it, it has gotten worse for sure. Because I, I, because yeah, like I don't know why people really like the change. Uh, I remember, I mean, part of it is that like I hold grudges because I'm petty as shit. So um, when I first put out a video uh, voicing the concerns, uh, I did not have the best reaction in the world. Um, I'm gonna keep that owl and I'm gonna just get rid of the crafted power. Okay, so never mind about that uh, owl, right? Right? No. Okay, I think that's everything. I'm gonna reroll the owl to get better uh, stats. But yeah, like, uh, people just like, a lot of people did not like it, or did not like that video. A lot of people like the change, which is fine. I mean, you absolutely, like, please love the change. Like, if that, if you liked it, like, please do. Like, just because I want to see it being, just because I want the melee system to uh, be different doesn't mean that, like, it's gonna happen, and it's completely fine if it doesn't. Like, I'm still playing the fucking game, you know? Like, I still obviously love it. Alright, so how cross works is basically um, throw it in front of you, it comes out back after a few sessions and seconds. It's like an advanced form of the boomerang. Think of it like that. Like boomerang's quite good, but uh, cross is just very good. I mean, which is a bit of a nothing statement. So basically like my strategy is like you can throw the cross out, and then on the way back, you're getting crits like kinda left and right. And with the 40% damage to uh, electrified targets, uh, it works out even better for you. So, I like to change a lot. So, like, yeah, right there. So, Slammer's coming towards me. I'm able to uh, just knock it out like that. Uh, question of where am I going to do this here? I have a couple of leads I need to battle. Are there any curses, first and foremost? I don't see any. So, first order of business is to go down. No, yeah, it's to go down. I think that'd be a much better idea. Okay, that was a good use of my scrolls. Okay, that's gonna be a hard one. Whoa! What the fuck? Dude, my like y'all see this, right? Like I statistically I should have gotten two in an amulet by now. I've gone the I've gone the long route. I'm very frustrated with this. Like actually frustrated. Finally, holy shit, dude. Took long enough. <laughs> like, legit, like, I was very much, uh, tilting over this. Is that what the kids say? I mean, two is fine. Like, two is completely okay. Got the wrong stat. 31 is good. Not the highest, but... Oh, you're right. Oh, right. Okay, this doesn't go through the enemies. And one more scroll up there, and then we're out of here. Oh, uh, no. I mean, there's no point. Unless, like, I want to get that electrodynamics. Because, like, I'm thinking, like, if I get something else... 
like the shrapnel might actually work here if I get the electrodynamics right. Wasn't there like a shrap like an electrodynamics over here? Or did I already like roll past it? Yeah, I already rolled past it. It's fine. No biggie. Where am I going? Giant. But I think this is pretty good synergy. Um, I wanna do I wanna get rid of the electric light? No, not for this fight. No, because my entire thing relies on point blank. I'm at two score right now. Okay. I actually did not get hit all of... Or unless I did. I forgot about it. Okay, so... Uh, shit. No, I don't think I have enough money to justify that. Alright, so first order of business, we're, we're real rolling this guy. Yeah, that's fine. I don't care about the 100%. Like, if I'm gonna get hit, I'm gonna get hit, you know? Alright. Let's do this. Okay, that was the dumbest fight of all time. All right, moving on. Moving on. That was that was that was certainly a fight. Giant, like I, I I said this earlier, Giant's a fucking joke. If like you have synergy on tactics, I very clearly have synergy on tactics right now. Like this is actually like I'm sticking with this. I think shrapnel. I don't need shrapnel right now, but I am curious as to what I get in this legendary pool. Let's see. Burns the ground when the effect ends. You know when this would have been good? It would have been good to fucking have it when I had um, Vampire Killer. Not, not, not doing that. That's, that's okay though. Um, do I want to go Distillery or High Peak? So, Shrek is the one with the uh, bonus. So, oh, Tight Peak. Do I just, do I just always go Distillery now? Distillery is more interesting. It's a good level. I actually really like it. Okay, well, if I have a Mimic, it's gonna... Okay, wh why do I need... I'm, I have level 12. I'm not gonna bother with this. Okay, that was a bit scary. But this level is fun to just kind of jump around and be wild. I do need to do a Magic Bow video. I don't think I've ever really used it, like, for a complete run. I don't know why. Like, I, because I, I legitimately cannot remember if it was good or not. I know it's a bit slow, but, like, I know it ramps up real quick. You wanna click? I, I haven't. Yeah, I, I definitely have not played this in a while. Because I forgot that what my strat is on this is typically to finish out the level and then you go to the uh, doors. Let's wait for this to come around. So I'm, uh, I'm on double damage. I do need to be careful. My longer range weapon is the cross, so I am going to make use of that. This is cool. I want to take a look at this. This is very pretty. I like it. But it also, like, I think that probably came out when Queen came out, huh? 
They caught me off guard, for sure. Okay. A lot of unexpected enemies so far. Over there is just uh, another chest that I don't really care about. Come on. Somewhere here. There it is. <sighs> Some nice movement going on. Playing pretty well here. Playing pretty fast and loose here. Place cleared, which is nice. Thirsty shield. Two stacks of bleed. Yeah, I'm good. I'm not really needing to parry. Plus, my thing is kind of dependent on like the double synergy thing. The, or the point blank synergy. This is really more of a point blank, sh blank showcase than anything else, honestly. Like, because point blank is really good. I know I said I didn't care about the test, but then I realized I actually need a little bit of money. Plus, I wanted to activate Instinct, just in case. Yeah, these are pretty cool lore rooms, I gotta say. I'm not gonna examine anything because I don't care enough, but like, still. three keys to get the second scroll basically is what it is all right this is the shorter path I'll, i just care about going the shorter path actually no i i think i said i was trying to do all of it right yeah because in case i get it I mean, Is it worth it going after every enemy is the question, I guess. Cause I almost got hit like four times there. Probably, right? So if you're too far away from a, for a roll, and this also applies to Hand of the Kings thing, um, all you need to do is just uh, run to the right and then um, you can get the thing again. 
And you should be able to like reset your roll pretty efficiently. It's fine. I got 60, like I'm not worried. Plus I got enough back on the recovery. But um, I have a lot of scrolls, like just in general, so that's really good. Last one, blue room. All right, this one's the slasher. I haven't seen a slasher in a while. That's interesting. I think the path that I took, you don't see slashers. Slashers. Right there. Luckily, he died before anything happened. Ooh, a legendary item. For now. Fighters crawl from the dead. Yes, what a great legendary affix. Alright, we're, we're out of here. Panther King time, baby. Uh, oh yeah, I'm already over here. So basic strategy for Hand of the King. Um, fire off the corrupted power as soon as the battle starts and activate the owl, run behind him, and then just start wailing on him. I'm just gonna knock him with the cross first and then hit him with the electric whip. It's better to put the cross first, I think. Because as he's doing that, then, yeah. Makes enough sense. I need the owl to activate the owl, that's right. Forgot about that. I, I killed the elites a little too quickly, so I had to make use of my double jump there. So having that extra jump actually really, really helped. All right, let's see what we get for legendary. They really should give a level 12 weapon for that legendary. So I think the only time I'll get it now is in this next level. It's a longer route. Oh, it's nearby. It's a dot route. Or it's an area of effect root. That's that's cool. That's cool. I like these legendary affixes. I mean, I don't have a legendary item with me, but I don't know all of them yet. So. You know, this is my first time in this level. In months. And not because I keep losing, but because, like, most of the game uh, that I've been practicing... Um, it just hasn't, that just hasn't been an option for me in a while. So, it's kind of cool to be uh, back here in Astral Lab. Not dealing with you. Okay. I want to activate all the teleporters first. right there. Okay. Electric whip. I already, don't I already have one? Yeah. Well, I mean, no shit, but like... 
I mean, unless this was like 400%, I'm not kidding. Oh! I, I just think this would be funny. Yeah, that's pretty funny. Anywhere else I need to go? I don't think so. Basically the same thing, isn't it? It's literally the same. Yeah, it's down to this fifty like literally the same amulet. Ooh. I'm just gonna play it safe on that. Like, I, I can go pot it, I can get the health pot, I can get the 50%. Like, if I get hit like, one more time, then I lose, so I'm not gonna, like, fucking die over something stupid like this. That was just a weird configuration for me. I, I don't see it a lot, so it's fine. I like, guess not a big deal. I mean, I am curious as to, like, what will be in here. Like, Hakuta's bow is basically the only thing that I would take at this point. Okay, I get correct. I correct. I stand corrected. Carbine. Yeah. So, Acrobat attacks point blank and... Heh, that's funny. I could have grabbed that. Alright, now I heal. I like that it has like infinite gear. Okay. Six, thirty, six, and six. I think that's our final scroll count. Should be the failed experiment over here, right? Come on. There we No more at least, that's alright. Nope, not I'm not triggering you yet. There we go. Okay. That was a really quick uh Yeah, that was quick. Six and seven. I probably I shouldn't have taken that. Would have gotten all sixes or all sevens. That'd have been cool. Or I would have gotten all sixes. Right?
That little rollback for the cross is so damn good. Like, I love that. Alright. So, uh, this is the build that I'll be screenshotting, putting it up on Imgur and posting it on the description. If you guys want to take a look at that too, there it is, all level 12s. Uh, synergy, basically. Um, don't worry about the carbine. I'm going to get that for the boss. Uh, but yeah. Let's just go into it. So, I think what we do here is we do Acrobata Pack, um, Point Blank, and Triage for the, uh, yeah, I think that's what we do. So, I don't want to activate the owl until I get there just because it, like, he takes a second sometimes. Like, right now I'll do it. I think I just activate both first, right? I think that's the plan. This is a one hit KO. <laughs> Good shit. No hit every boss. Um, I, I'm, I'm happy with that. That was a good run. I mean, so my RNG didn't even pick up until the like, cavern, I would say. And like, sometimes you just have to adapt with what you have. So that kanji fight, I very much had to adapt to like my, st just my build. And once it got rolling and I decided I'm going full electricity here, um, the carbine was just like the, the cherry on the top. That It was basically the difference between he three heals on the first phase rather than two heals, right? Which, you know, it works out. And uh, I made one mistake against the collector in that I forgot to pick up the... I, I just wasn't in a position to pick up the pot because of the, uh, um, the downward attack. But every boss, no hit. Only took a few hits throughout the run. Tactics is busted uh, when you synergize right. Uh, and even when you don't synergize right, as long as you keep your distance, uh, you're good to go. So, thank you guys for joining me. Really appreciate you taking time out of your day to watch my content. And uh, if you want to leave a like, go ahead and do that. If not, that's totally fine. But uh, see you all later. Have a great night, everybody, and stay safe.